Good morning, everybody. Do you have your koala crate, your koala music crate? It's the one with the yellow box. It has a little koala on it, and it will say music. We're going to try and make a xylophone today. Are you ready? Let's open it. So to make our xylophone, we're going to need a couple things. You're going to need this box here that has some nudges notches on it. You're going to need your map, your xylophone bars, which are these wooden bars. It's in the same packet that has the tambourine. I don't know if you can see it. The part for the tambourine and the mallets. So you're going to need the mallets for the xylophone as well. There's going to be this package that has some rubber bands in it. You're going to need that. And you'll need these for later. These are going to be your music sheets. It has little scrolls on it. It says compose. Right here and have circles on it and there's your stampers that you're going to use to make your music notes. So Elise is going to open up the instructions. Your instructions are going to be in this packet and it says for grown-ups. It says for the grown-up assistant. Now the first step would be to mark our xylophone bars. You should have four xylophone bars. We're going to mark them using our stampers. Now, when you use the stamper, you may have to press down and twist to really leave a mark. You're go we're going to mark them from smallest to biggest using the colors green, yellow, blue, and then pink. Now that we've marked our xylophone bars with the different stampers, let's see. And remember, please don't lose these stampers. You're going to need it for our other projects, too, in the box. We're going to take the rubber bands. They were in the plastic bag and put two on each of the larger indents, just like this. That's one. Whoops, it's a little tricky. And that'll make two. There should be four rubber bands in your box. See, there are two rubber bands on the edge. At least you should put them. Actually, it looks like there's more than four rubber bands. One on the other side, and then two. So now that we have our rubber bands on our box, we're going to slide the bars through the rubber bands. So we'll slide the first bar in so it's being held by the rubber band, just like this. Now the next part is going to be very tricky. You're going to want to crisscross it so it holds the next bar and it wraps around it. Once you crisscrossed it and your bars are in place, you've made your xylophone. Remember, it's called a xylophone because your bars are made of wood. They're not metal. Now you can go ahead and make some music. At least you'll play with you, see? These are called your mallets. You will need these to play the xylophone. Hold on, please hold on to everything because you're going to need it for our other projects. Now this here is your music sheet. It says compose and it should open up. You, it's the size of the stamper. You make the dots and you can make some music. This is your music sheet and you'll use these for your music notes. Okay, until next time, bye.